Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about the options Greeks. Um, if you didn't already know, every options contract, whether it be calls, puts, um, they all have a set of Greek values that help determine the options pricing. So we have on our screen Apple uh, 129 strike calls expiring February 26 next week. And we can see we have a set of five Greek values. So first one is Delta. We have Gamma, Theta, Vega, and Rho. The last one has to do with interest rates, and that is not very important. So we want to focus on these four main ones, with Delta and Theta being particularly important. These are the main ones that you're going to be focusing on because it has a lot to do with the options pricing. So... What is the first one? Delta. Delta is basically the expected move for a $1 price movement in the underlying stock. So if Apple goes up $1 to 130 we are going to get around $310 for our contract. We're adding the Delta to the premium and we get around $310. Same thing if the stock goes down to 128 we're going to be subtracting the delta, so we'll get around $210 for our new options pricing. The second Greek value is gamma, and it is basically measuring the, the delta. So for every $1 price movement in the stock, we're going to be adding um, 6 to the delta. So the new delta would be 0 .60, 63 around there. Um, and same thing if the stock drops to 129 or 128 rather we will subtract the gamma from the delta and our new delta would be around 40 uh, 44 somewhere around there um, and we can we can check our math by taking a look at the strikes below it and above it um, as we can see the, the delta below it is roughly the sum of these two values, the gamma and the delta of the previous one. And as you can take a look at the 131, it is 0.48, which is roughly um, subtracting the delta from the gamma here. Um, but that's not too important. It's, it's mainly delta and theta. And so let's go on to the next one. So theta is how much value you are losing every single day due to time decay. Um, so in this case, we're losing $14 from this contract every single day, assuming that the stock stays flat. And data is the main reason why I sell um, options. It's because these contracts, they bleed out every day and you make money even if the market is flat. So I am on the selling end of this and I make a ton of money. Uh, not, not crazy money, but like it's consistent and very profitable for me as an options seller. And Vega is the fourth Greek that you should know. And it is basically how much your contract will change due to a point increase or decrease in implied volatility. So in this case, if implied volatility goes to 30.65%, our contract will be worth more will have an additional seven dollars added to our to our contract premium for each point of implied volatility and this starts to ramp up during um, big news events such as earnings calls so uh, contracts tend to have a higher premium right before earnings uh, that's about it for this video. If you have any questions or want me to elaborate more on any of these Greek values um, and how to utilize the Greek values to determine what type of strikes uh, and expirations you have, please leave a comment down below. But for this video, thanks for watching.